Greetings from Kentucky. I wanted to get on to talk about two orders that I placed from Open Sky. Open Sky is kind of like Outlook a, a little. It's like Outlook meets Instagram meets maybe Pinterest. You follow things. It's got some social media built into it. I'm not really sure what I think about it because it feels a little bit overwhelming, but the deals come into your box. And so, yes, I placed an order with them. You have to be very, very careful to place your order because these are products that generally... If they can be returned, there's going to be a restocking fee. So I purchased products that I know I like and I was able to get them at a good price. So let me show you the two things that I got. The first thing I got was my Youthful Trends Caffeinated Makeup Primer. Don't tend to use this in the winter, but spring, summer, fall, this is a product that I use both before as a primer and also on top of my makeup. In the winter, I'm more likely to use the Celtic Complexion Winter Skin Balm, that new product that she came out with. Before that, I was using the 100% Pure Superfruits Balm, and I would use those to touch up. But now that the weather is shifting a bit, Youthful Trends Caffeinated Makeup Primer is always the product that I prefer. I was able to get it at a sale price on Open Sky, and I got an extra discount, I think because it was the first order I placed on Open Sky, or I got it with one of the percent offs that they, they gave. So yes, Youthful Trends Caffeinated Makeup Primer. I was almost out of my other one, and so now I have another one ready to go. The second product I got, and no surprise here, it is the Christopher Drummond, and it is the Pro Kit. It comes in this nice little box. You open it up like so, and you can see the products that are in it. It's a cute little box or a cute little bag, and it was nice to get it on sale. The Christopher Drummond, I think, might be still on sale, but my guess is that if you sign up for Open Sky and get on their email list before long, they will send you coupons off for it. So there is a little card by Christopher Drummond. It has the makeup application tips. It tells you, for example, that the Duo Face Concealer can be used as a concealer or as a foundation. It tells you to apply the Voluto Velvet Foundation in layers and to swipe it on. I've been buffing it, but it says no buffing is needed, just simple, long strokes. I might try that this summer with my paddle brush from Sedona Lace. That's at the Beach Heads. But for now, I'm using the It Cosmetics brush, which means that I'm more likely to buff with that than to swipe it on. It talks a little bit about the Finale Finishing Powder, which gives an airbrush look, and that is a really nice product. In the bag itself, I got another Radiance Booster. This is the Sao Jupele, which I love, so I have more of that. I got more of the Finale Finishing Powder. Love that. Got more of the Voluto Velvet Foundation in Ivory, and I got it also in Light. I had left my Light with my niece, and then I had, I believe maybe one other light, and then I've gotten a light kit which also has that medium beige or golden beige, something like that, but I really wanted another light. But wait, wait, there's more. There is a matte blush in the shade Summer. That would be my second Christopher Drummond blush. There is another one of these little kabuki brushes, the minis. There is the skin prep, which I don't use because this has phenoxyethanol, so this one I'll pass along. And a product I haven't received a sample of yet, which is the Revitalizing Facial Serum. The last thing it comes with is a brochure about Christopher Drummond and about the products that are offered in the line. I think, believe it or not, it's the first time I've got one of these, and so I'm looking forward to reading through that. So, yeah, I like this. I love this little presentation. It has an extra pocket on the outside right there. That'll be good for some little samples, flat samples. I can put those there. And, again, there is that inside nice little bag and this was the Christopher Drummond Pro Kit. I think now if I had to choose between the Discovery Kit on sale or the Pro Kit on sale I'd definitely go for the Pro Kit. I've also gotten the Women's Kit and I like that. It has slightly bigger products but in terms of presentation I have to say this has been my favorite so far. I know it looks like a lot of Christopher Drummond but I am a Christopher Drummond enthusiast and I can even imagine that I will share some of these with friends because I like introducing friends to products that I love. I introduced my sister-in-law to Celtic Complexion. She lives in Arizona. I went to put makeup on her and her skin after she'd put a moisturizer on 
was dry. I looked at her and I said, you have got to try the Celtic complexion. She got the winter skin kit and she said, holy cow, her skin is so much more supple and the makeup goes on better. So I can imagine with some of that Christopher Drummond that it's going to make its way into gifties. At this point now, I really am stocked up on the foundation and the basics, the foundation, the finishing powder, as well as the Sauge Pelle, which I adore all of those. That is it for my orders from Open Sky. I don't think I'll be ordering anything else from Open Sky in the near future. However, you never know. Those offers come through in your mailbox and you go, holy cow, I should pick that up. As always, thank you so much for watching. If you've ordered from Open Sky or if you know anything about Open Sky or if you have a different impression of Open Sky than I have, again, I think it's like Outlook meets social media. That's the best way I can describe it. It does have these sales, these kind of flash sales, but on the other hand, it also has this kind of follow, leave comments, almost like uh, Facebook pages, only it's newer technology than Facebook tends to be. So very, very interesting in that regard, but it does feel a little overwhelming to me, and I do think you do have to watch because you don't want to get stuck with restocking fees. As always, of course, make it a great, great day. Let me know what you're up to. Bye.